sometimes you need to check that an exception is correctly thrown from your code as you expect. And PyTest supports that too. Welcome back to our final video in this PyTest in PyCharm series. Let's add this new test to check for the case where we ask for a primary guardian before any guardians have been assigned to the player. We can use PyTest raises context manager to assert that a code block or function call raises the exception that we expect. To make it more interesting, let's say that we're expecting a key error exception. Straight away, because our tests are still auto rerunning, we can see that the test has failed. This means that our code does not throw a key error exception. In fact, we can see that it's expecting an index error exception. Let's change it to index error, and now our test is passing, meaning we're correctly getting the exception that we expect. It's good, but it's a bit clunky. True. Let's refactor our code to avoid this case and return none in this instance. That way, we won't need to check for this exception. The test is now failing correctly, so let's head over to our code, refactor it, and fix it. Let's add a type ending for our return type, saying it can be either guardian or none using Python's optional generic type. We'll change the property to detect an empty list, and in that case, return none instead. Great. Our tests are now passing, so we are almost wrapped up here. Before I leave you, here is a quick reminder on everything PyTest inside PyCharm. Remember, TDD mode can be really helpful. Code on the left, test on the right, run tool window at the bottom with your tests auto rerunning. There are many ways to run tests inside PyCharm. You can use your keyboard shortcuts, your gutter icons, your right click context menu in the editor or the project tool window, or your run configurations. I hope you've enjoyed our journey of PyTest in PyCharm and you learned some cool stuff along the way. If you like this video, don't forget to hit like and subscribe to this channel for more PyCharm content. In the meantime, you can use this QR code to access all our PyTest content over on our JetBrains guide.